having a group of people to hang with when you didn't want to do the typical high school hangout party, to have that alternative was huge because you don't want to go home and hang out with mom and dad. But if you don't want to be at the high school party, where are you going to go? And she would just end up hanging with the squad kids all the time. Before the squad, she was making some high school decisions that involved partying and drinking and some choices that she wouldn't be proud of today. But after the squad and the people that she was hanging around with, her commitment, her passion for Christ, it's so innately who she is. It's just a part of every day. Before he started there, he was just really um, kind of a depressed person. So when he started squad, um, he immediately started to open up and um, made like 30 new best friends. He's not judged with this group. Everybody's welcomed when they come into this group. It was a nice, I would say tight-knit group, but they didn't exclude anyone. They opened the door and opened their arms to anybody who wanted to join. The biggest way that the squad impacted our family was just in the overall attitude of Abby at home. I think she seemed more relaxed and more comfortable with herself, having this great group of friends to fall back on. It also has helped her relationship with her brother. I think he looks up to her and sees the great friends that she has in high school and the fun that she has with this group of Christian friends. So we've been coming to Oak Ridge since Keller and her dad just started coming to church in probably the last six months. And we gently would ask him every week to come and he saw her involvement. And if anybody knows Emily, her passion just is out there. And so just one Sunday, he got dressed and it's just been every Sunday. It's just, an, it's just a part of our family. Gannon has been a great influence on his younger brother, Cole. Cole is now involved with the squad and enjoying it every bit as much as Gannon has. The squad has impacted me as a mom, and I'll apologize if I get emotional. But having a safe place for Abby to go, to hang out with great kids, was such a blessing for me to be able to see that. I think without squad, Abby would be a different person and I would probably be a different mom. There used to be a lot of times where I would be up at night, upset, crying, worried about him and what he was going through. And now I know that he's got so many friends here at the church and not only squad, but the leaders. She comes to me with things that I don't think she would have come to me with prior to being in squad. There's a level of comfort in our conversations and I attribute that to being surrounded by Christian fellowship. It has impacted me to some degree because I watched him and I was busy volunteering and doing things outside of church and realized I needed to get involved in my church here. I can honestly say there is no better way to spend your money. Sign on the dotted line, get them signed up, do it as quick and as fast uh, as you can. It will pay for itself a hundred times over if you just get them here. The people, the leaders, the pastors, everybody will impact their life and you'll not regret it.